we live in the generations now the generations are right doing that yep we're doing that we're doing that poetry isn't working on, on this visual world oh yeah facebook isn't helping poetry youtube isn't helping poetry you know twitter I isn't helping poetry i disagree entirely I disagree entirely. There are lots of uh, websites and Facebook posts and, and uh, YouTube videos of poets reciting poetry, of, 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 of people writing their own poetry and posting it for the world to like or dislike, for people uh, dropping poems online as opposed to trying to get them printed in little magazines. Yeah. So there's a very live... Uh, uh, poetry universe, which may still be relatively small in comparison with the with the sports universe, or in comparison with the business news universe, but it's there. And, and the thing is, compared to the Marvel comic action film universe, you are totally inconsequential. You're right. You know, yeah, in terms you're right. of the economics, in terms of the social attention, in terms of generations going, I want to be like the. Yeah, it's like. Oh. That's right, but that's why that's why uh, poets are the most subtle and insidious, <laughs> uh, sly uh, artists, and I say guerrilla artists around, uh, because the works survive. The works survive by being passed around, uh, poetry lover to poetry lover. They survive in terms of of moments of crisis or moments of celebration when nothing but a poem is going to suffice. Nothing but a poem spoken or sung is going to be useful in that moment. Nothing else is going to work. You can't, you know, you want to, you're going to mourn somebody, you're going to put on a video. Yeah, you can put the video on and show excerpts of, the, of their lives and the baby pictures and so on. But for someone to stand up and recite a poem about that deceased person, that person who's gone, and what that person meant to him or her or them or that community, ah, that's going to have everybody reaching for their Kleenex. That's going to have everybody uh, in tears or reaching for another drink or what have you as they celebrate the dearly departed. Uh, because poetry is, is one of the arts that's most naked in getting to the nakedness of ourselves, which is always emotion. The naked part of ourselves is our emotion. That's it. That's that's the real nudity. It's the emotion, and if you, and the poem is what is what wants to touch that. The poem wants to get there. It wants to get to your emotion, and yes, have your intellectual understanding, but also your your emotional reaction.